السلام عليكم for the criminals that they are and all you have to read is confessions of an economic hitman to know the type of things that they do in these third world countries to create permanent debt now they have they're borrowing from from the Federal Reserve at 1% and they're loaning it out to students at 7% student loans to get an education in the United States. The student debt in the United States now is $1.2 trillion. It's criminal that students go to school now and they come out with debts of $100,000, $200,000 if they go to high, uh, very expensive schools. These are criminal activities done. There's now greater student debt in my country than there is credit card debt. And this is because they want people to be permanent servicers of debt. This is a new type of slavery, indentured servitude, mortgage, mortgage, the death grip until you die. But Allah says, Ya ayyuhalladheena amanu taqullah. Guard yourselves against God. Guard yourselves against God. Wa dharu ma baqiya min al-riba. In kuntum mu'mineen. If you're believers, guard yourselves. Avoid usury. فَإِن لَمْ تَفْعَلُوا فَأَذَنُوا بِحَرْبٍ مِّنَ اللَّهِ وَرَسُولِهِ And if you don't know that there's going to be a war, Allah will bring it down. God will bring it down. He'll bring the system down. It will collapse. It's been on the verge of collapse several times and it will collapse. Another major reason is the consumer society itself. I shop, therefore I am. This is one of the things that man boasts about in the Quran. Yaquru ahlaktu mal al I have consumed great quantities of wealth. Consumer, it first emerged in the English language in the 1530s as one who squanders and wastes. Consumer is also in Old English, it's a name of the devil. Another major reason is a war economy. Look at the United States, look how much they spend on weapons. The next closest country is China. And we can see now this emerging problem between China and the United States. And I said this over 10 years ago that the Muslims are just a paper tiger right now until China gets reared up. And then just to keep this arms race going, to keep Raytheon and General Electric and all these corporations that bring good things to death, right? Just for them to make all of their money. This is human greed. This is the result of building these bombs. This is what happens to human beings when we allow these mad people to rule our economies, to govern our, our nations. These are insane people. There's no reason for us to fight the Iranians. My country has, I have nothing against any of those Iranian people on the street in Tehran, nothing whatsoever. And if I met them, we'd sit down and have tea and speak and talk. I have nothing against the Iraqi people. I have nothing against the Egyptian people. I have nothing against the Russian people. If you don't step on my toes, I don't step on your toes. But we have, we have rulers in power that are making billions of dollars, billions of dollars. And the people, the puppets that are put into power to represent them, not to represent us, to represent them. These puppets that create wars because they have war economies and then they come in with all of their contracts and they rebuild these countries and we fall for it again and again and again. Human beings, not just Muslims, human beings should wake up to what's happening to us, to what's happening to our planet. Syria, over one million houses destroyed. Do you know how hard it is to build a house? Do you know how much time it takes to earn the money to build a house? One million houses destroyed, five million refugees. Where did they get the armaments? Who's supplying them? Who wins in these games? Certainly not the human beings that are at the brunt of all of this violence. Look at the government budgets in relation to education throughout the world. This is insanity. These weapons of mass destruction have nothing to do with us. They should, our money should not be going to these things. Our tax dollars should not be going to these things. This is sinister. Another major reason is oil consumption. And this cannot continue on. It can't. It will not continue on. People